FRC Team 1939, the Barstow Knigets, believes that FIRST's mission extends far beyond robots. Our goal is to spread the message of Dean Kamen by building a better world and a brighter future through STEM. That's why each year during the holiday season, we host a huge Go Baby Go event teaching other FIRST teams how to use adaptive technologies to hack ride-on toy cars to make motorized wheelchairs for children with disabilities. With this year's event, our team will have built more than 75 Go Baby Go cars. Over the past five years, we've become global leaders, connecting FIRST teams with Go Baby Go. My team and I presented at FIRST World Championships in Houston. We've also created numerous how-to manuals, including how to hack a Fisher-Price Wild Thing into a Go Baby Go joystick-controlled wheelchair, which has been used by teams across the country. But our favorite event each year is our huge Go Baby Go community build and hackathon. Over the years, more than 21 first teams have dedicated their time and STEM skills to give the gift of mobility to children with challenges such as spinal bifida, cerebral palsy, and Down syndrome. And through our hackathon, experienced teams are paired with children with more specialized challenges, such as visual impairments. Teams are asked to create an inventive, adaptive technology solution in order to help the child overcome the challenge. So this year we had a girl named Anna. She has cerebral palsy, so she doesn't have the best mobility in her arms and legs. She also doesn't have that much muscle strength and has hard vision. So first we added a car seat so that way she can be able to sit right and be stable within the car. We added the joystick and took out the steering wheel and the gas pedal so that way she can easily move the car with her arms. We have a sensor. It was originally a sound sensor but we talked to the family and found out that sound sensors aren't the best for her. So instead we put a light sensor. So I think the kids uh, right now are in a state where they can't really comprehend fully what's going on, but they know that they're being able to move. Like They know that they're doing what they need to do to grow. And it's so fulfilling when you see their smiles on their faces. We've won gone to world. We've uh, built robots. We've been an amazing team. But nothing compares to when you see a child move for the very first time. So Brooklyn's three years old. She was diagnosed um, at nine weeks old with a terminal disease called spinal muscular atrophy, or SMA type 1. It's a nerve and muscle disease, so all of her movement was taken from her around 10 weeks old. So she could only move her eyes and a little bit of her head. She lost all control of arms, legs, um, lost her swallow, so she's G2 fed and was put on several machines to keep her alive. Um, but she's on a new medication called Spinraza, and since then she has started to gain her movement back one finger at a time. And now since she's been on it for so long, she's moving quite a bit now. Even Do you love your new purple car? You do? So Brooklyn has four older brothers, and they are not special needs, so they are able just to jump into any toy. So this car, for Brooklyn to be able to be next to her brothers outside and riding, is very unique and special to her because she doesn't have anything like this. Um, and to feel like she's one with her brothers and to feel like she's able to get outside and just to play and move on her own since she isn't able to walk, um, it's, it's a huge blessing to her. So she'll have some more independence and more playtime for sure next to her brothers. We'll say that I feel like this year's cars were advanced over last year's cars in the, in the, in the hackathon. Um, and, and, and it's sort of like this whole event is growing and getting more sophisticated each year. So, I mean, just, just from the event point of view as well as the vehicles and, and, and the way that people are participating in this, it's really, it's really pretty cool. Go Baby Go has really grown over the years and it's given me an opportunity to let my STEM students learn how they can use their skills to make lives better for others. And the thing that really warms my heart is seeing the looks not just on the faces of the kids uh, that we build the cars for, but also on the faces of my students and the parents and the adult volunteers that we have. It's a life-changing experience for all involved. It's very special that you all took time out of your busy schedules to make this not only for Brooklyn, but for all the kids here. So from our whole entire family, we want to say thank, thank you. you very much. Can you say thank you? Love you. 
it's an emotional event for everyone involved. For some of these children, it's the first time they've ever had control over their ability to move. We love the fact that the STEM skills we've learned through FIRST can change these families' lives. Find out how your FIRST team can get involved with Go Baby Go. You can find our slideshow we presented at Championships on our team's website, www.frcteam1939.com, and click on Go Baby Go. Or you can find all our how-to manuals on our forum, www.gbgconnect.com.